Shops. Are we are we recording just now? We are. Right. What are you doing on the third of um April? Uh fuck all, I don't know. What are you doing on the fourth of April? Don't know. Fifth? Nothing. Sixth? Hey, yeah, I don't plan that far ahead. You don't plan no. that far ahead. Okay, that's good. Since you are my number one confidant, my senior member here at Yes, we are taking all the staff to Marbella. All right, okay. If you would, if your missus is going to let you go, so we get to fly the flight we're going on. Everyone has their boobies out. So, right. I'll, I'll bleep that bit out for her. <laughs> She's going to be watching. So, if you're free, let me know. I'll make time for it, mate. Hang. There we go. Good. As long as, long as I'm knowing cattle class, all right? Stick as a business class. <laughs> nah, it's a gem. A gem. Yeah. <laughs> I go to the one at uh, the key. No, key's a fucking one in your mouth, kid. Aye, I go to the. Aye, I know that, but I'm just saying that, like. So, Kieran's brought his BMW today because. He, he knows that I'm here. He didn't bring his Mini Cooper. The reason why we're here, higher level martial arts here in, I don't know, Whitburn, Bathgate, whatever you want to call it, I'm not too well versed with these areas, mine is coming here, is because fighting is an essential skill in life, right? If you are especially a man and you're watching this and you don't know how to fight, now when I say how to fight, listen to me clearly here, I don't care if you see red and bodies hit the floor. I don't care. If you just see red and you get angry and you start knocking cunts out, right? See, when you meet someone who appears skinny like myself and you try and do that to me and they're saying, BAH! You're out cold. Seeing red is not going to help. You're going to be seeing the back of your eyelids. Now, as you know, I broke my hand eight or nine weeks ago. It's my first session back. My knuckles fucking disappeared. So, hopefully I don't re-break it. If we get that on video, that would be fucking unbelievable. And high level's the best gym in Scotland. UFC fighters, Bellator fighters, PFL fighters, you name it. Um, we might even see a couple of them today, who knows. So this is Kieran. He is you? a defeated MMA fighter. Zero wins, ten losses. Kieran Reid Coppins fight. <laughs> By the way, I was unfair to Kieran. Kieran, BJ Brown Bell, undefeated MMA fighter. He's only ever lost in the gym to me, which is good, but he's still not, not bad. How long have you been training with Richard? Uh, a year, or in general, a bit. I don't know, I'll have a year. Yeah, Kieran used to bully me in school. He's Kieran's girlfriend. Stayed next door to me at my old house and I used to fancy her. So he bullied me at school and then turned me into the man I know. I play COD tonight. I've done the today, so. Aye, yeah. Aye, but uh, I'm going in. Finished. Whack, whack, whack. That's what I did. That's amazing. Imagine you are someone watching this, especially, like I said, especially young men. You're watching this and you're thinking to yourself, you know, I, I don't know if I can look after myself in any type of physical situation. I'm not saying that you need to go and train like a professional fighter. You need to train every single day of the week. If you're sitting there and you've done nothing in your life to learn how to fight, not a single thing, minus watch some videos online or whatever, you're useless. You need to think about the bigger picture. Your friends, your family, your kids, your wife, your boyfriend, whoever. The people that you need to look after who are in your 
circle. You might be out in the street one day, someone tries to grab the phone, tries to touch the girlfriend inappropriately, you don't do something about it. You're a bitch, basically, and women don't like bitches, right? So make sure, local MMA gym, go to boxing gym, jiu-jitsu gym, do one session a week, two sessions a week, whatever. Just don't do Aikido and karate and all this shit. So, stay up to date.